Well, just in time for Father's Day and picnic season, we're ready to tempt your taste buds with a trip around the state to sample some of the top barbecue joints in Indiana, from Bomber's Barbecue in Munster to Bo Doogie's in Auburn. Yelp's Brittany Smith has you covered with five of the state's best places to find a who's your favorite. And Brittany joins us now in our Trindiana segment. Brittany, always great to see you. Likewise, thanks, Gary. Okay, barbecue is always popular, especially in the summertime. You've got a great tour put together for us. We begin close to home here in central Indiana at Trax Barbecue in McCordsville. Yeah, the owners, Andrew and Whitney, there are serving up Carolina style barbecue, slow cooking meats. And the thing that Yelpers really love in the reviews there is that you can also pair it with a visit to the local cap, uh, craft beer from Scarlet Lane Brewery, all under the same roof. So you get a bo both of uh, best of both worlds. And they are known for their pulled chicken sandwich and their Texas toast and beef brisket sandwich. And barbecue and beer, of course, always a great combination. And Scarlet Lane, as you know, Brittany, uh, really one of the great uh, craft brewers. Uh, here in our state. Uh, okay, let's move uh, to closer to downtown Indianapolis, Fletcher Place and Old Gold Barbecue. Yeah, this is another fun pairing of a barbecue and brewery business that support one another. You're actually going to see Old Gold Barbecue parked right there in the parking lot of Metazoa Brewing, which has a beautiful backdrop of downtown Indy. Very dog friendly business as well. They're serving up Central Texas style barbecue. They are putting it on the pit for over 14 to 16 hours. Low and slow is the name of the game. And pork ribs and pulled pork, along with their green chili mac and cheese, are some of the most popular dishes and reviews. Yeah, and I know a pro tip as well, uh, Brittany, is it's a great place to watch the 4th of July fireworks coming back to downtown Indianapolis uh, uh, July 4th. So that's, uh, that's a good tip there. Uh, let's go to Northwest Indiana now. Bombers Barbecue is in Munster. Yeah, they opened in 2013. They're open seven days a week, but in classic barbecue style, this is one of the places that you want to get there early because no guarantee that they're going to have it. They do sell out often. They are known for their rib tips platter, and this one's kind of a surprise, the Bang Bang Shrimp Appetizer, oh. which has flour fried, tossed in sweet barbecue sauce, and drizzle with a little sriracha mayo. Wow, tasty. Okay, my favorite name, I think, Bo Doogie's <laughs> Barbecue is in Auburn in northeast Indiana, just north of Fort Wayne. Exactly. It's hickory slow or slow smoked meats. They've got a lot of those classic southern side dishes. Um, yep. It's very casual. Carryouts available, and the smoked mac and cheese is one of the most popular items there. Okay, we end up with the newest arrival, really, on the barbecue scene in Indiana, Gomez Barbecue, and that's on the Near East side of Indianapolis. Yeah, originally opened at City Market, where they also have a location. Now they're right there on the Near East side, and they are known for their smoked pastrami sandwiches, the pulled pork sandwich, which you've got right there in front of you, the Cuban sandwich as well. They're also doing some coffee options earlier in the day, and people love their smoked tofu. For those who maybe don't eat, uh, you know, meats, that's got another great option there all under one roof. Yeah, really in a developing area on the Near East uh, side as well. And we're looking at a live shot there, Brittany, of some of the great stuff from uh, Gomez. I can smell it. It's very close here. I'm going to have to... <laughs> Sneak a bite when we get off the air here. Brittany, as yeah. always, a great job, great tour around the state of Indiana. I uh, look forward to seeing you next time. Thanks so much, Gary. Okay.